Hello there. Now, we are going to determine whether the infinite geometric series converges or diverges. And if it converges, we are going to find its sum. Now, here's the, what we're going to do, what you are going to do on your test. You're going to look at this um, infinite geometric series. And you're going to find the ratio. Okay, first, find the ratio. So ratio equals to the second term over the first term, right? That would be equal to half over 2, which would be equal to 1 fourth. So that's our ratio for this. And there's a rule that says that if, if r is smaller than 1, now let me take off this here, some of you might get confused. I've noticed that with the semester. So if r is smaller than 1, then the series does the opposite of what Shailene Woodley did in that movie. It converges. Yeah. So we have r equals to 1 over 4. And 1 over 4 is smaller than 1. So r series converges. Now we know that, and since it converges, we need to find its sum. And how are we going to find its sum? Its sum. Well, we're going to use this formula right here. A1 over 1 minus R, which would be equal to our first term, 2 over 1 minus our ratio, 1 over 4. And that would be equal to, drum rolls, 8 over 3. So oh, so there's our answers. The, ser the series converges and its sum is 8 over 3. Now let's do this one. So get our r, a2 over a1, which would be equal to 2 negative 5 over 4 over 5 is equal to negative 1 fourth. So negative 1 fourth is smaller than 1, right? So in, we have a series that converges. This converges and its sum is going to be the first term over 1 minus the ratio. So 5 over 1 minus negative 1 fourth would be equal to drum roll 4 and that is the sum okay now for this one right here it might look a little bit more complicated but it's definitely not because you're going to use this you're going to use the fact that e K1 infinity of A1 R K minus 1 is equal to A1 over 1 minus R. Okay? So, just by looking at this, okay, you can, you can get your A1 and your R, right? So, let's see. Mm. You just take a look at R. What's R? 4. Okay? So this R is here. And our A1 is here. 1 over 6. But we only need the R. And the R is 4. And since the R is greater than 1, this is divergent. So it diverges diverges like Shailene Woodley yeah okay so it diverges and that's what you do with those ones just let, take a look at the ratio remember the ratio is the one next to the K okay and that's it so good luck with your test and goodbye